come on welcome back to the channel i'm hank strange this is stranger palooza and behind us we have the winnebago travado 59k look at that guy right there look at that guy you guys have probably missed him there he goes nick schmidt sunshine state rv we are going to get into the 2022 winnebago travado 59k right now let's do it all right nick yes it's been a while man it has you've been traveling the world leaving me behind here in gainesville oh uh, you've been having fun trust me i, I always know, have fun i know you're having fun okay so tell us what's different or interesting about the so uh, first i'm nick i'm with sunshine state rvs typically hank introduces me <laughs> we're a class b dealership here in gainesville florida we're the number one class b dealership in the state of Florida, I, I'm number pretty sure three I introduced him. Yeah, <laughs> in the United States of America, this is all we do are class BRVs. I'm glad Soon to be to here be. with my friend Hank. Number one, Nick. Ah, that's that's, what, that's big. Yeah, that's big. We got like triple ourselves. To working number on one. number one. Working on number one. Quadruple. Yeah. So I have taken a quick look at this. It's it, sharp, isn't it? Yeah. It's actually. I don't think I've ever seen a ProMaster like that. I'm not gonna say it's the most luxurious thing because we've done yeah, luxurious we've, stuff. We've done some pretty luxurious It's really ones. nice in there though. It is, it is. If you're looking at class B RVs, mm -hmm. the one that sells the most every year for a long time has been Winnebago. Mm -hmm. So Winnebago sells more class B coaches than anybody else. Mm -hmm. And their number one selling RV is the Travato. So that's what this is. This is the Winnebago Travato. It's a 2022. Now, they make two floor plans in that. You've done a video, or we've done a video on the G, which is the one with that corner bed that kind of folds down, oh, that yeah, corner yeah. bath right. and all that. Yes. So we did a G. This is their other floor plan in the Travato. This is a K. Kay. So they make the G and they make the K. They sell way more the K than anything else. So when I say this is the top selling Class B RV on the market, it's from the top selling company, Winnebago, their top selling line, Travato, right. and it's top selling model the K. So this is more Travato K's are sold than any other class B RV in so, the country every day. So just like my translation, Nick, if you don't know specifically what you want, it's probably this one. It, it might be. It might be. It might be. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Because like you said, most popular, most popular company, yeah, most popular model and make everything, the whole thing. Okay. It's and great. And you'll see why you're going to love yeah. it. I mean, there's, you know, there's a lot to love about this Winnebago. There's a lot to love. There is. So it's 2022. 2022, 2022 on a Let's... Pro Master. This is a 21 Pro Master chassis. Okay. So some of the cool things about the 21 Pro Master chassis mm -hmm. is that it has that digital rear view mirror everybody asked me about. Oh, yeah. does it have the digital rear view mirror? Last time I sat in one, I was watching. I felt like I was playing a video game. I was watching that mirror. It was like a camera. Not all the Pro Masters have that. Not all of them do. The 21s do okay. with the options. It also has a crosswind assist. So that kind of gives you a little stabilization. Um, it also has a blind spot monitoring, which I think is huge. So there's little triangles yeah. that light up in the corner of your mirrors. Mm -hmm. So if you're driving along and someone sneaks into your blind spot, instead of having to turn around and finagle your neck, you can see that little uh, triangle yeah. in in the top of the mirror to know somebody's in your blind spot. So Dodge ProMaster just started coming out with that safety feature. Yeah, so this is a front engine, obviously. Yep, it's a V6 made by Ram. It gets you about 20 miles to the gallon. And uh, Great. it's like 280 Front. horsepower, 288, some, it's good horsepower. Something like that. I mean, it's nothing yeah. compared to your Audi. It's not here today for me to show, but your nice little fancy <laughs> Iron Man Audi car is, is a lot faster. I drove I drove a ProMaster recently. Oh, really? And they are really easy to drive. Yeah. No, yeah. they're great. They're you sit sporty. up high. Yeah. People like that you sit up high in it. Mm -hmm. V6, front wheel drive, so real easy to control. Yeah. Yeah, they're great. Yeah. We sell more of these than probably any other chassis. Yeah. You know, there just seems to be more of them for some reason. Yeah. I, I haven't put out that video yet, Nick. Oh. That's the thing. The video is not out there, but it's coming. I don't know what you're talking about. Where I actually drove the Pro Master, uh -huh. I drove the Sprinter, and I drove a Ford. Oh, okay. And you compare them. Yeah, and nice. I compare them. And this was uh, this is one of those things I was telling you don't earlier. Don't give it away. Don't give it away. Sometimes you tell me stuff, and I'm like, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> you did tell me that. <laughs> and then I drove this, and I was like, oh, it's easy to drive. It is. So if you can, you know, like I think like as a, as a really big person, mm -hmm. maybe you, you won't feel as comfortable. But I think if There's you're... There's just a lot to love of you, Hank. Yeah, well, yeah, we can go with that. <laughs> but yes, it's, uh, you know, because it's 
because of how this is so short here, yeah. you get a really good view out. You're getting good power. You're getting front wheel drive. Okay. It is. It is. And what really I get from people a lot is they feel like you're sitting high, which people yeah. really like, especially when you're spending a lot of time on the road. Yeah. You sit up a little higher. You can see everything around you. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty cool. So there's a W out here. I don't know if you guys can see it. That's, that stands uh, for uh, Winnebago. Winnebago, right there. Yep. You guys can see that. Uh, so nice something pretty right cool on this one here. A few options. Um, the painted bumpers. Oh. So everything that we order here at Sunshine State RVs, we, we like to get all the options. So everything loaded mm -hmm. up with everything they offer. Painted bumpers, painted wheel covers. Some of them have like, uh, for instance, here, sneak over here real quick. Okay. This is really cool. You're going to get a, a cool sneak peek here. Uh -oh. So this is another Travato. This is their national park model. This is oh. like a rare albatross, a rare bird. Yes. This one does not have the painted. No, painted, this is all plastic. But look at what it has. It has the nice wheels. The it has a nice. nice graphics package. Yeah. The National Park Foundation. So this, they don't make these. This is pretty sweet. They made, like, these are limited. they only made a hundred of them, I think, oh, okay. last year. So. Yeah. Anyway, one for sale? Is that... uh, I'm not telling anything. Oh. Hank. Okay. I just want to show you the difference between someone's going to want to buy it. <laughs> the the plastic bumpers right. and wheel overs versus yeah. that one, which has the color coded bumpers. People people tend to like it. Does the, look good. It does, doesn't it? it makes it I think it's good. sharp. Uh, I was thinking. I was looking at it, trying to figure out what it was that makes it look good. It looks yeah. like there's a roof rack up there too. But yeah, it looks good. So something pretty cool that Winnebago does. They do it a, a step on the whole thing. You know, some companies do a step just for the driver, then a second one yeah. for the passenger. But this is a Winnebago, nice big step. And it's got W's. It does have a little W's all in it. Yep. Something else really cool that I love about Winnebago Travados is this window. The, um, the Coachman Nova has it as well, mm -hmm. but this is a pop top awning style window. They are made in Europe. It's mm -hmm. like a, a duo form, dual pane. Feels like plastic almost. It's yeah, not but glass. It's, but it's got a very clear picture through it. It does. When you see the it does. windows. And it's great because you can pass things through here. Yeah. Um, you can let fresh air in. So there's one on the other side too. Yeah. You pop that open, that, that cross ventilation. A sneak peek of what it looks like inside. That cross ventilation is great. Yeah, and so if it's if it's raining. If it's raining. You're not gonna get as much rain in there. If you've got a light rain, you can still have that open. That is true. Yeah, very nice. As you keep coming. Let's Under see. your awning, so you have a big power awning here, mm -hmm. um, and through the power awning, you can you can have a plug underneath here. So if you want to plug in a, a little electric grill, you want to plug in um, some music, mm -hmm. Christmas lights, whatever you got. Yeah. And, then, <laughs> and then this is this is a cable jack. This is a 12 volt jack here, and then this is a solar extension. So uh, what's that? Zamp Solar. Mm -hmm. So so what you do is you can get uh, an extra hundred. A uh, hundred amp or hundred watt solar panel, you can get five thousand watts of solar. You can get as much solar as you want. Plug it in. Maybe not quite five. That's an yeah, exaggeration. I don't know. I don't know if you can definitely get a hundred to two hundred. Right I know. Now. I know. I I like to talk in big. <laughs> so you can get some ex some extra solar. How's yeah. that? Yes. And you can plug it in right there. You can put it here, point it towards yeah. the sun, and it yeah. can help charge your battery. Solar's yeah. great in these things because it's like a trickle charger. You know, yeah. if you turn everything off. In the middle of the night, um, you're you're sleeping. Your fridge is probably running on your battery. Right now, the weather's beautiful. You don't need the AC on, mm -hmm. so probably just your fridge is running on your battery. The solar is going to keep that battery charged up. It's going to store some energy for you, and mm -hmm. it's going to help you get through the night. Help you keep your battery charged yeah. all the time. It's great. Is this um is this lithium or generator? So yeah, this particular yeah. one is the generator model. Generator. They okay. do make a KL. Mm -hmm. The K is the floor plan. The L stands for lithium, mm -hmm. um, and it's a and it's a great Volta lithium system. Mm -hmm. um, there are some pretty cool things, and I'll talk about that more when we get into coach. I'm going to talk about this like it's a lithium model and a generator. So I'm going to I'm going to talk about both together, right? Um, because it's the same RV. It'll just have either lithium or an Onan generator. Right. There you go. All right. So very cool. Let's uh, keep going around the side. Cool there. So as as we come around the back here, this can have a bike rack here. Um, you have a ladder here. The ladder can take you up top to check out the solar panels and all that. One of my favorite. Should we do a sneak peek inside? Yeah. And one of does look good inside. One of my yeah. favorite things about oh, the K good. model, and this is new too for 22. I like these. These are these are really neat. You don't have to store the covers anywhere, and when you want to see out of them, you just That's let so it down, awesome. 
and you have light, and when you don't want to see, and it's thick. Feel how thick that is, Hank. Yeah, it's got good insulation. In I mean, it. I oh, like this. lots of insulation. And it's got this, you know. It is. If you want to take it down, if you want to do something with it. Yeah. yeah, that's good. But you don't have to store it somewhere. Everybody, you know, storage is definitely a premium when it comes to these Class B coaches. Mm -hmm. And just having it be able to stay there is great. Not have yeah. to go rummaging through stuff and find it, get it out, put it yeah. up. It's just always there. To it's get awesome. a set of bags like that for, for your van, if you already have it, it's going to cost you some hundreds of dollars. Some hundreds of dollars. Yes. I've, I've, I know this because I've looked into it. <laughs> I know this, man. <laughs> so here's another one. This is yeah. great. Uh -huh. This here holds your trusty toilet paper from TV, getting wet. TV. You should have one of these in your beyond. Yeah, I do. But that's, it, it's, you know, it's nice having it in the door like that because if you sat out here for some reason. Oh, remember, we installed it for you. Yeah. <laughs> So, so uh, this and then what is this? That's a what towel is it? rack. Towel rack. That is there. a towel rack. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so what's great about this bathroom? So I'm a big guy. I can get in this bathroom. I can fit. I can elbow. I can spin around. Mm -hmm. I can dance. This bathroom, the rear bath is a huge bathroom compared so to the side bathroom. The K is the rear bath. The K is the, is the rear bath. The yes. one for me. The one for me. There well, that's go. that's the same beyond you have. Yeah. Coachman Nova also makes mm -hmm. a rear bath model, mm -hmm. so that's a great floor plan. It's it's very similar it's to this. Cool. So I notice in here, this is this like the teak flooring? That that's is cool. the teak floor. Yeah. Nice to have. It um, is. Nice cabinets. I like the finish. Yeah. So there's a shower cabinets. curtain that will that will cover that. Yo, look at that. Lots of store. Oh, it's pretty big in there. Yeah. Lots right of storage. There. A big wardrobe. Yeah. There's a grab, big, there's a grab handle nope, there. Yep. Grab handle. So this is something pretty new for 22 as well. So if you look, these don't just open. Mm -hmm. You have to very lightly just do this. Oh. And it's like a, a positive, what's it called? Posi track, something. I don't know. Yeah. So this is new. You're asking the wrong person to This know is the new name for 2022. Yeah. So it's pretty nice. Nice yeah. handle here to help you in when you need to get in. Right. Uh, let's see what's so, under here. Is this uh, plumbing? <laughs> That's where you hide uh, fire sticks. <laughs> uh, oh, I see. Oh, nice. All kinds of cool <laughs> things. Yeah. Um, and your then, toilet, your, it looks like you got a shower. That's well, a bidet. This, this is not a bidet. Uh, I can be a bidet. Okay. If this is for your dog or something, I'm guessing. Or right? a bidet. If you guys. And what's okay. wrong with the bidet? Okay. I mean, I'm part French. <laughs> sure. <laughs> not really. Exactly. So, this, this so is a nice bathroom. 2022 is nice as well. This is a new shower head. Mm -hmm. So, this is a nice big shower head, nice, sturdy, handheld. Shower head here, you know, right. you can wash uh -huh. yourself, uh -huh. put it back up. So you fit perfectly in this I, I, I mean, really, I do. I'm standing up, I'm, I'm six foot tall, 224 and three quarters of a pound. <laughs> 224 and three quarters. Right, okay. I weigh myself every morning, Hank. Yes, I, I that's a good thing to do. That's so, thing to do. I fit very well <laughs> yeah. here. What so, is here, this? Oh, this is where sink. I brush my teeth, spit it out. Dump it. It goes back in there. This is doing some pretty good space saving stuff. Wash what are those hands, switches? Shave. Switches here. This is the light in here, and this is the water pump for back oh, here. Okay. Yes. So, so you nice don't have mirror. to get someone to turn it on for you. Nice you mirror, and then you have a medicine cabinet in here. Right. Just show that. There you go. Awesome. Nice PVC. Yeah. Marine grade, high quality. And then you've got a separate hot uh, cold water knob. here. Yeah. And hot cold water here. So you got water coming out of here for this, water coming out of yeah. here for this. When you're done with this, you lift it up and it just goes back down Closes to the drain. Everything. All yeah. of this stuff drains into your gray tank. So this and that drain to your gray tank. Mm -hmm. This drains into your black tank. Black tank, yeah. Yep, so that's really nice that's, there. Yeah, this is a cool Like bathroom. I said, you know, you're here, you bidet, you move mm -hmm. on with life. If you need to brush your teeth while you're on the uh -huh. toilet, you can do that. <laughs> yeah, get creative, man. Come yeah. on. Okay. Yeah, we'll see all the creative ways you do this. But this actually is a pretty cool bathroom. And there's a fan in here, which is pretty important. People nice always ask fan. about the fan in the bathroom. Yeah. So that's pretty cool. This is also pretty neat. So if you did want to leave these doors open mm -hmm. and you wanted a screen. Boom. Check it out. Yeah. You have a screen. Once again, it comes with it. It does. Yeah. If you need to buy one, they're very expensive. But yeah. Winnebago gives you one. So yeah, yeah pretty sweet. Yeah. I'm telling and you, the bathroom. And it's, and it's solid down here to try to like mask you off privacy. your business. Yes. So your business is not all out there. So one of the things that people really like about this floor plan is that size of the bathroom. Yeah. That's why we're spending so much time in here yeah. because 
you know, a lot of them have twin beds. The twin beds can make into a king bed. They have TVs and, and microwave, all that fun stuff up front. But having a big bathroom that you can actually maneuver in and fit in makes this RV very livable, very usable, very flexible to what, how, however you want to use it. Mm -hmm. it's, it's just such a great floor plan in the back here. So this is also new to 2022. This is the water system. So okay. we get a lot, a lot of questions about this, Hank. Right. Why is the water system inside the coach, you may ask? You yeah, may why be, do I have to like open the why door? Why do you have to open the door? I'm glad you asked me that question, <laughs> Hank. Yeah. And the reason is Winnebago is really trying to get to a Four Seasons coach. Okay. They wanted you to be able to use this RV not just here in sunny Florida, in Gainesville, mm -hmm. home of the fighting Florida Gators who okay. have a subpar football team this year, <laughs> but we're still the fighting Florida Gators. Right. Not just here in Florida, but anywhere in the United States, no matter where you go, they want you to be able to use this coach 365 days a year. What's the definition nowadays of four seasons? So I every see people ask that in the video. They ask it all the time. Yeah. And, is it four seasons? Is and it, what is it? So so Winnebago really did a good job of moving this in the coach, mm -hmm. keeping all the pipes, all the tubes, everything there, mm -hmm. so they can make this more. So you have an outside shower. I don't know where it is. Let's see. At least oh, just, oh, just here it is. Here. That's cool. There is stuff. This, yeah. this is a shower curtain that's not installed right now. Yeah. And, and then the there's a out. This is what I was looking for, right is, here. Plugs. So let's button this bad boy back up. I like this. Here and here. Right. So this is your shower, your outside shower here. Yep. So quick that goes connect. there. Quick connect. This is what you use for your dog or your feet. Right. Like that. This is not a bidet, guys. Once you plug it in properly. This would be a high pressure bidet right. if it was a bidet. <laughs> Everything is a bidet in your world. So this okay. is what this is for. Door has to be open. So there's obviously pros and cons. When you're mm -hmm. trying to fit as much stuff into a 20 foot RV as we're trying to fit into the, I say we, I don't build them. I just mm -hmm. tell you about them. You just if, yeah. if Winnebago is trying to fit as much stuff into this 20 foot RV as they possibly can, some things are going to have to double as other things. So yeah. you're going to have to open the door to use this, to use city so, water. So this is where you would uh, make all your connections Correct. if you were dumping, or let's say no, you're, not if you're dumping. staying at the camp, you have to connect to this. If you're staying at the okay. camp, you can mm -hmm. fill your fresh water tank and you and, can use that. And then, then, and then disconnect and close everything. You can disconnect and close it. So the only way, the, the only reason you, you would need to connect to this mm -hmm. is if you want to fill your fresh water tank. Or so empty. that's right here. Yeah. It, no, not empty. Oh. So. If you want to be hooked up to city yeah. water, you can be hooked up here for a constant flow. If you just want to fill it, you can do that. If you want to do your, your quick connect, like I just showed, you can do that. Satellite or cable TV there as well. Oh, okay. So, All right. so what but I would recommend... There's no way to close the door and no. have that connection still going. Okay. What I recommend you do is mm. you keep this where they had it. When you want to use it, you open the door, you use it, you put it back, you shut your door. Yeah. When you're going camping, you fill your fresh water tank and you camp out of that. When that's empty, you open this door for three minutes, mm -hmm. you fill your fresh water tank again, and do it again. Mm -hmm. And what that's gonna give you, that's gonna give you the flexibility of camping year round. Mm -hmm. If you wanna go to the upper peninsula of Michigan, I don't know why you'd wanna go there, but if you do wanna go there, I hear it's beautiful, it's just cold, and mm -hmm. guys like me and Hank, I know we well, don't do the cold, cold too well. So when people are talking cold. four season, what temperatures are they talking about the cold? Are so, we talking zero or minus so, zero? Yeah, yeah. I don't know, to be honest, yeah. the exact number. I'm not dealing with anything near zero, I, that's what I know. No, I'm not either. So that, yeah, we live in Florida. 32 degrees at freezing yes. is as far yes. as I ever want to see anything. So I, I don't know that exact number, okay. but when they they did this movement mm -hmm. to make this what they're calling a Four Seasons Coach. I always recommend putting a little glycol in your system, making sure, you know, always take those precautions because the last thing you want is a busted line that freezes that okay, is the cool. last thing and want. then so just quick things here i don't Sorry. know if you have other stuff i noticed there's a light back here nick there is, is a light back here yeah very cool click so it on right here a light switch that right there there's yep. power and then power 12 volts. 12 volt okay you finish here we got all this good stuff here doors open you can even use the plug with the door shut mm -hmm. all that stuff is good so nice great area back here mm -hmm. you know what's also great is if you're not going to use the bathroom you can just slide stuff in the back you know this is rolled up Plenty of room to slide mm -hmm. stuff in the back, two by fours, plywood, yeah. luggage, dog You've got crates. Got open floor plan that you can very, do. very open floor plan. Yeah. So it's great. So, awesome. Let's move on, my friend. Okay. Ladder to go up. There is a ladder is, is to go up. Going up the ladder. Oh, I am happy to go up the ladder, yes. my friend. Go up the ladder. 
I'll let you temporarily do some camera work. Oh, I thank you. Do I get paid extra for this? <laughs> no. So here we are. We have the big solar panel. We have our King Air satellite or uh, antenna here. See, there's even more room to put solar. They got an extra solar jack back here. You can put more solar. Oh, there is. Right there. Right there. Um, and then you have a big solar panel up front. You have your Max Air vent up there. You have your Coleman Mach air, air conditioner. And this is a quiet 110 air conditioner made by Coleman. It's a great AC. So lots yeah. and lots of solar. Lots of solar. <laughs> All right. So there's actually a lot of cool stuff up there. There is. Lots yeah. of cool stuff. So here on the side, I noticed there's another light out here on this side. There is, yes. There's yeah. a light here. And this light's mainly for when you're dumping. So this is where you would uh, do your dumping right okay. here. Yeah. So this here is your exhaust to your Onan generator. Mm -hmm. And then this is your tank here. So this is where you will dump. Um, this is just fluid Black from tank. us flushing the tank yeah. out. This is you a brand. See, that's like almost pink or something. So RV. Yeah. That's how they they come, right? They, put they do. This yep. Kind of fluid yep. in there. So that way they don't freeze. Yeah. So so what you would do is you would grab your hose that is stored right here. Mm -hmm. You would grab this hose, walk it two steps right here, hook it in, hook it in the ground, pull the lever, and, and then down yeah. she goes. Yes. Yeah. And then when you're done. Get, get your little shower hose there. Most dump stations have a hose right there. You just hose your little- Wash everything off. Uh, yeah, wash the hose out, bring it right back, stick it right in there. Put it in there. And you're okay, good. Cool. And, and so is that your black and your gray over there? It is. Okay, so that's both. And then yep. this I think is the propane. This is the propane fill. So this okay. is where you turn it, the emergency shut on and off. And that's where you'll pull into a fill station to fill it. Okay. And- uh, This is where you would hook your 30 amp service. Something pretty neat about it. I like it when it has a light on it and the 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 power cord has a light as well. So that way when you are in there and you're hooked in, that light is lit up so you know you're getting the power you need. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, and I'm guessing this is the exhaust for the engine. That is the exhaust for the engine. Okay. Nice big step as well, just like we talked about before mm -hmm. for the uh, Winnebago. So yeah, yeah. so pretty and it's, neat. It, it's gas. It is gas. So it's our seats are turned around right now. Yeah, for folks who don't know, it's uh, there's the there's the notch, gas. So that's a good thing. Some people don't want to do diesel. So that is true. Yeah, yeah, all the Promasters that they build RVs on are gas. Yeah. So now we get to walk inside. Yeah, let's go inside, Nick. Beauty. I'm right behind you. That is my good side. Go with it. I don't know. <laughs> all right. So yeah, the interior of this is beautiful, starting with the floor. Look at the floors, man. That's, yeah. pretty, that's pretty good looking floors right there. I'll go up in here. I like the fact that uh, so you when, know, everything's over here versus what you usually see. Like in my van, that stuff is over there also. But Yeah, so Winnebago does a great job here with this area. So Winnebago is really trying to attract the, the working people in their coaches. Mm -hmm. So a lot of people buy these coaches so they can work from them. And, and Winnebago does a great job. This is all new for 2022. So this little thing right here folds all the way down oh. and stores right in here. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, very neat. Okay. And then and then that is just where the magnet sticks. So then oh, you kind of pick it up like this. Flip it over. Flip it over. And now oh, you have a little wow. dinette for this side for the driver. And that's got a pretty good hold on it. Okay. Put nice. your water bottle on it. Yeah. Then this one is a lagoon table. Mm -hmm. Lagoon has taken the RV industry by storm. Everybody loves lagoon tables. Yeah. So I like this one, Nick. If you look under there, there's cutouts, so that helps make this lighter, right? Yes, this is a very light yeah. table. Yeah. Um, yeah, and this is pretty neat as well. Check this thing out. So this has... Oh, tower of power. The tower of power. So you have 110 plug there. That's cool. You have two, two 110s and two USBs. So if you're working here on a laptop, you uh, plug in right there. You can you can charge things up and work yeah, forever. You can have a meeting right here. You people. can. We're having a meeting you right now. Lunch. <laughs> We're two yeah. or more gathered. Yeah. So you got some stats for us? Well, just some of the new stuff. So you know, on the mm -hmm. interior here, they uh, they did a, a wind sleep system, okay. which which is the beds. And we'll talk about that in a second. Um, they also did on the floor, they did a honeycomb composite insulated flooring, which is a great upgrade on the flooring. The JBL Bluetooth soundbar, the snap and rear screen, which we already covered, 
the rear the rear window coverings straight safety strap which you guys saw me pull uh, the rear annex which is what those bars are to make uh, for the rear living right mm -hmm. lagoon table the new cabinet latches which i already talked about mm -hmm. the pvc floor mat and the roll-off screen which we showed the back screen then we'll show the the side oh, this, screen. This, this, so that would be this. That that's is a, yeah, here. yeah, yeah. That's we'll a, show that before. That's we standard. This. Before you had to pay like an extra six hundred bucks for it just to get that. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So what we talked about earlier was the water system, the improved winterization uh, package, the eco hot, which we haven't talked about yet, mm -hmm. and then some of the other. This was the optional upgrade, the four module Volta energy pack. So earlier in the video, I I showed you a national park. Mm -hmm. One of the things that people loved about the National Park was it had 25% more lithium than a traditional KL or GL, like traditional uh, lithium model. Okay. So now they're making that much lithium available on one of these Travados. Mm. So if you, if, I mean, Travado has a phenomenal lithium system. It's a Volta. It's a one touch system. You press one button, everything turns on mm -hmm. and it's all, all hooked up. You don't have to worry about inverters and settings and all this stuff. You press one button. And it's a very smart system. It mm -hmm. turns on, press one button, it turns off. Okay. Very simple system. I like um, that. Yeah. Uh, are, we, are we gonna look at that up here? Is that well, what? so since this is not a lithium system, oh, of course. we don't have that <laughs> magic button. That makes sense. <laughs> yes, I can show you to in another RV, but this one does not have it. Right. It's a great system. Volta does a great job. They have like a seven year warranty on their lithium batteries. I gotta tell you, out of all the Winnebago's we sold, and we're one of the top Winnebago Travado dealers in the Eastern United States. We have never had to replace a battery. Okay. And, and we've been doing this for years for them. Never had to replace one of their batteries. They're, it's a great system. The air conditioner can run all night. The fridge. I mean, just the way they have it set up is a great system. Winnebago does a good job. They do the underhood generator, the big 3000 watt inverter, the, the, the big battery pack. I mean, it right. just runs everything. So if you have that lithium package, you're getting a different generator, I take it. So you're getting one. the underhood generator which is like a second bigger beefier alternator okay you're not getting the onan generator so this unit has the onan generator that yeah. powers all of that the lithium so that's a kl mm. has the the whole lithium system this is not the lithium right and you would model. get a different air conditioner as well same air conditioner oh same yep. 110 yep. air conditioner yep. oh, they, okay they do the coleman the quiet coleman mach 10 and in, in, in every unit that they oh. sell oh cool yeah okay so let's uh, see what else is here. I see there's a big shelf space up here for storage. There is. Yeah, no, it's great. There's, there's guys room for big. pillows and it sheets. It goes all the way back. All, yeah, all yeah. kinds of good yeah. stuff. There. So People that's love good. that. Yeah. Something new for this year also is this color. So a white cabinet. I like that. I like there. the white and the and the, and the like brown, the brown kind of wood color. thing. Yeah, it looks good. Cool. But they're, again, really cool. Oh, you got to pull that You got to pull it to open it. If you don't pull it, you can't open it. So you got to pull it to open it. So. So great job by Winnebago there. I it's really like that. It's almost like Hank proof. Man, nothing's really Hank proof. Yeah. You're kind of <laughs> like, like a bowl in a china cabinet. <laughs> okay, and the backing of this is probably it is, you yeah, know, it's beautiful. It's it's got it. Yeah, it's not because I know you get felt sometimes in some things, so that's yeah, cool. Yeah, no, they got that wood backing. Yeah, they finish open. it out with some nice. wood. I'm opening every single one, Nick. Oh, you're like a child, Hank. Yes, I know. <laughs> You're like you like my favorite customers in the world that come in and touch every button. You should have never every, taught me how to open these. Open every compartment, touch every, every button. <laughs> yeah, that's a lot of storage, though. It's a lot, and it's on the other side, too. Yeah. So, over here, we uh -huh. have it there and there. Uh, ooh. And there's your solar charge controller. Uh, okay. So, so one thing Winnebago does great, because they have such a great system, dude, they put plugs everywhere, Hank. I mean, I got two here. Two there, I got 12 volt and a USB. I mean, there's more power here than I had in my first apartment, I think. Well, and that, well, that makes sense because a lot of people might leave their laptops stored up here. Yeah, that's and, true. And iPads and different devices, so you can have it up there and have it uh, charging. That's true. Yeah, there no. you go. Well, uh, you want to switch me in? I can talk about these yes, beds absolutely. for a second. Let's switch around here so that you don't, at least that way people can see you. Uh, yeah. Look. The, the W. I, the I like w. finding the Just like a, like a purse holder, a coat okay. rack. So the one touch system would be right here. So I'll show you okay. another coach. The one touch system, you turn it on right there. Very cool. What do we and have? this one, this is where you start your generator right here. Mm -hmm. So it's a very quiet generator. This is the same generator you have in your Beyond. Okay. It is a, a quiet Onan generator. It's their brand yeah. new generator they just came out with. It is National Park approved. So you are allowed 
to run this Onan generator in a national park overnight. Yeah, that's, it that, is so quiet. That's one of those other things that you say that I'm always like, whatever. And then the other day, I don't know if you saw this video, but Lola and I were in Virginia. Yeah. And we were out in a, on like a farm field. And yeah. we had the generator running and we left. It was running all day. And when we came back, we were both saying it's not on. It's definitely on. It was on. 100%. You have to walk like right up on the van to hear it. So... Okay, that's all you get, Nick. So I'm no, turning you into a believer, Hank. No, no just those two I mean, things. I, two things. I kind of know what I'm talking about two, sometimes. Two things that I two said, Two things, Nick. that's it. That's so, it. <laughs> this is the tank heater. So, this is part of that Four Seasons, um, part of the coach. I see. That we talked about earlier. Keeping the tanks heated is a very important part of of the uh, Four Seasons capability. So, okay. this is the uh, JBL Bluetooth soundbar. So, you can pull your phone out and you can play music what? from your phone. To a sound bar. A sound bar that is hooked up. You can Bluetooth it. I don't think it. I've seen a. I don't think I've seen a sound bar in one of these vans. Yet. Yeah. So that's the first time I've seen the, a sound bar, right? The, yeah. The uh, the other Travato that we did the video on has one as well. The oh, 59G. Yep. Yep. Oh, okay. I don't remember us talking about yeah, that. Pretty yeah, pretty cool. Oh, that's sweet. I like that. Okay. So pretty cool. neat. Also, we talk about shades here. So this is the nighttime shade when you go to sleep, give you some privacy. <laughs> And you have a screen here for daytime. Mm -hmm. So this window here actually slides open and you have the shade there. Oh, I see. The other ones are an awning, but you can't have two awnings back to back. They won't go through. Yeah. This one here has the screen that goes down. Right, and then this it is has the night, style, night no shade that goes there. up. Yeah. And then awning style one, yeah. two, Pop that bad boy three, open, it's getting one, hot in here. Even though two, this is a nice, check uh, that out. what are we in October? We is. October, yeah, October 19th. I mean, yeah. we're mid-October. I think in October when you do your videos, you should uh, dress up in costume. Should I? I think so. I, I am actually in costume right now. No, no but like I'm saying. Like, My son looked, looked at me the Halloween. other day and said, Daddy, why do you always wear the same clothes? <laughs> I'm like, you wear a uniform to school every day. Uniform. I wear a uniform to work every day. He's like, ah, yeah. that's true. Yeah. <laughs> We need to do some videos uh, during Halloween time. It'll yes. think we're dressed up as superheroes or I'm something. In. I'm in. Yeah. Okay, so this is pretty neat. This is a good place oh, to I put think. your phone yeah. at night. Put it here. Charge it here. There is a... Um, there was a... Is a... I thought there was a yeah. 110 thing in there. Oh, no. Really? A little USB port in there? No? Yeah. I like the light, though. The light is and interesting. And it's a sweet light. I thought there was a USB in there. Oh. There is there is something right here. There's two there. there. Oh, you know what? There it is. They moved it on me. Okay. There are two USBs right oh, there. Oh, there you go. Right. So that's a great place to put it. What so, are those switches right there for? Hydraulics. Oh. Okay. Enjoy. Lights. <laughs> so you don't have to. Okay. So pretty nice there. So this is pretty sweet. So ba on both sides, you've got these baskets. You do, you do. These baskets cool. are new. I think last year they started doing these yeah. baskets. You can buy these in. separately, but it's cool to see it come with it. Yeah. You know, but people can't get them. It's got a nice little magnet there. On it does. You. Yeah, pretty sweet. That's and it's awesome. cool. Like even this little tiny window. The more windows, the better, Nick. That's personally. true. I opinion. like it. I like it. I could feel a little bit of breeze already. Like it's hot. <laughs> Just a little bit. Yeah, it's so, hot in here. Pretty nice. cool about these beds. So very comfortable cushion here. This is a nice material on here too. This is a close up. Nice thick yeah. material. Oh look, there's a 110 plug. Like I said everywhere they put these plugs. It's crazy. Yeah. It's crazy. So nice uh nice cushion, but then when you lift it up. Oh, you have, this is that brand new oh. bed system that they oh. just came out with. Pretty sweet. So that that pulls out? It does. Maybe? Are so we doing it, it makes it very comfortable. We is doing it. Okay, here we go. Look, Look at that. that. What? That's like magic. There. What? Put it down. Put it. And this could carry weight? It can. We're about to find out, Hank. It's like, I feel like I'm in Ikea. Today's oh, hold the day. On. Wait, hold on a second. Do I need to go slow motion? Are you going on here? Look at that! <laughs> I will climb. <laughs> yeah, don't on do it. And let no, I'm roll. sure the engineer. I'm sure the engineer. That's nice though. I like it, and I like the cutout kind of thing here. So Can you, I stop doing this. Yes. Oh, thank you. <laughs> yeah. No, this is great. That's actually a. Big Isn't that deal. cool? I mean, really? Look at that. Yeah. That's so awesome. You can, you can have a whole complete like if. You know, if it's husband and wife traveling, you don't necessarily want to be separated. But it is great to have this like passageway here. So, like so what I hear people in. say all the time is, "Man, that's a great area for my dog." You know, husband, mm -hmm. wife, dog. You got one person, two dogs. 
you know, there's a man. I feel that breeze coming through. This is nice. <laughs> there's so a lot of options. A lot yeah. of options. I got four kids. Me, and my wife, and my four kids. I do not think we'll fit in this situation here. Um, do not you know, think so. I think everyone's skinny except you. That is probably that is definitely a true statement. <laughs> my wife has the, the jeans. I, I wear the jeans. That is it. So, yeah. but this is this is big. I, this might be bigger than a, than a real king size bed. No, I this mean. Is, yeah, this is pretty good. It's good. It's great that it comes with it. You know, I have a floor plan like this, except inside of a Ford. Yep. And that's something that we don't. And yours have. does not do this. Um, but we actually just got something made so that we could bridge it like this, and nice. it's really convenient when you could do that. I, you know, one thing yeah. I like in the past, the, this is a very common thing so a lot of RVs mm -hmm. have the twin beds you put something in the middle yeah what what they've always looked like or pieces of wood yeah that you're storing somewhere yeah, you're picking look, them up you lay yeah. them down it's not this I looks mean, like furniture I mean, like this is, uh, so, I mean, look at that I'm done yeah, yeah. look how easy that is That's and cool. in case you're wondering there are hooks here that you can hook it in so this oh. is a zoomy z-o-m-i okay so what you do is you pull this you see that little hook there right we'll hook there Oh, there, okay. there. So there's a, this is like a thought out uh, engineered system. So Winnebago thinks things out a lot. Mm -hmm. And they thought that out. Yeah, no, so, that's, that's pretty cool. Something man. else pretty cool yeah, here. Like we do have some more storage under here. What? So there's a little hidden compartment there. Yes, very nice. Pretty cool. And then we come over to the other side. Uh, let's see. Here. Very nice as well. So this whole thing. Oh, what? Yeah, big storage. Oh, there. so you could put all like big coats and actually, one yeah. of my kids could fit in there. I bet you could actually put batteries down there too. Man, just or, of that. I mean, yeah. I mean Battleborn batteries are great if you want to convert <laughs> yeah. one of these things. Yeah, one of can, these generator models yeah. to a lithium model. You can you put, could put a you could put, put a three hundred amp Battleborn. You can put a hundred. I mean, you can probably put four or five hundred amps in there. A Battleborn battery is good. I like the fact that they did this. You man. love Battleborn, don't you? Yes, I do. There's a link in the description. <laughs> Uh, no, I'm trying not, to help my boy you're out. You're not getting a commission. I'm trying to help my boy out. <laughs> I so, appreciate it, man. Look at this thing. This thing's just snuck up on me. Look at that. What do you think that is, Hank? Yeah, well, that's a lagoon. Ooh, that's a lagoon. What do you think about so moving that can, right here? Yeah, so you can move this one over there, which is... Pretty sweet, right? Yeah. I actually like this. I really do like this layout here. We're, we're, we're not taking Beyonds on trade today, Hank. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> People would love to have my Beyond. They would. You know, the they would. Hank Strange Mobile. Morgan. The Hank Morgan. Strange Mobile. <laughs> so, yeah. As we're moving into the kitchen, yeah, let's I go like, to the kitchen stuff here. And just to be clear, we always take Beyonds on trade. I was just joking. Yeah, Hank. exactly. We uh, take anything on trade like from to rubber ducks to pickup trucks. From <laughs> oh, mm. uh, there's there's a there's a local car dealership that has <laughs> yeah. a funny commercial. But not you. That, You're not that, taking rubber ducks. That they take rubber ducks and pickup trucks uh -huh. and on trade. That's a so, lot of rubber ducks. So we will take rubber ducks and pickup trucks. So this great is, kitchen. We have another tower of power here. Yeah. This Check that bad boy is out. Really cool. I mean. Really, if I count how many plugs are in here, one, two, three, four, five, six on the other, seven, eight. One down there. Nine. There's I a couple you, in the back. We saw some in the, out the back. Out the back, there, that's 10. There's probably mm. 11 or 12. And then on the side. Oh, there's one right here. Yeah, there was like one on the side. 11 plugs. On the side outside, remember? Oh, yeah, on the front. There's like there's 12 110 plugs in here. Yeah, is that another storage thing right there? Uh, yeah, that is. Oh, wow. Isn't that awesome? Yeah, this has great storage. Let me, let me shine some light in there for you. Yeah. Uh, you know, they need to build, actually, some uh, Ford models like this. I'm guessing Winnebago doesn't do Fords at this point? Um, Winnebago do does not do the transit, no. Oh, okay. Yeah. I love this layout, though. So, okay, so this kitchen actually has a lot of cool things yep, in it. Yep, so power, that's power kind of here. Saving it for last. So we got two plugs, two USBs. We have another one of these magical windows. Okay. That helps guys like me and Hank uh, not sweat while we do a video. Yeah. Uh, slow. <laughs> slow. There it is. <laughs> so, okay. something else pretty cool that Winnebago does. And I never really got into this too much, but I, I have heard talk to people that have. Oh, so this is a Ram this track. Is, this is a, a little Ram track. Yeah. So you pull it off here. You can remove that. You can you put pull it off here. up there. And then you can put it oh. like so. The way that you need it. Wherever you need it, you can put something in here. I don't know like, why you'll be putting it in backwards. I don't know, but it doesn't really fit this way. Then, <laughs> how do I put it in? That well, you way? could put any Ram track thing. There's a lot. Oh, here we we can put this yeah, one here if we want. Yeah. Oh, I so didn't right even there, see the Ram track. The whole, you can move it wherever you want. Yeah, this is actually okay. And so they put, they have these. You can put a fan in there. So they make little fans that have these things on it. That you can put a fan there facing on you. Mm -hmm. You can put lights. You can. Put
put little storage cubbies like this. I'm telling you, Nick, if this was all wheel drive and had a little bit more room up here, I might I might trade in now, Alright, we'll leave that there right for right now. Um Yeah, pretty, yeah, the pretty you, nice. You don't need this. <laughs> <laughs> nice big sink. Nice thing gets out of the way, moves, does everything you need. Right. We have a gas stove right here. They do offer induction as well. Yeah. So what I like is that it's flat. Uh, if you need to make a sandwich or you're or you're prepping food, you can use this prep kitchen area right here as well, just like this. Flop it around, and you can use this as part of your prep kitchen. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I have sold these types of RVs to real chefs that that really get a kick out of making okay. like gourmet meals out of the smallest kitchen possible. It's like a mm -hmm. challenge to them. Like, yeah. give me four ingredients in a small kitchen, I'm gonna blow your mind. I'm like, wow, that's like pretty exciting yeah. to hear. Yeah. So, pretty neat that you have this area here. You do have a little storage. Yeah, was that a bottle opener I saw there? No, oh, no, 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 that's, that's, the, that's, the, that's the new that's handle. The, yeah, the new handles, which is, mm -hmm. I like this too, because you can hang stuff on it if you wanted to. That yeah, maybe. Yeah. Uh, Winnebago may not cover that. <laughs> Winnebago may not cover that in a warranty if you hang something heavy on there. Uh, fridge, <laughs> yes. Nova Cool. Nova Cool. Um, you know, not the biggest fridge, but, but for the so, layout, so here, there again, you're not going for the biggest. Just like fridge, in right? your coach and mm -hmm. in a lot of other 20 foot, 22 foot coaches, you mm -hmm. have you have trade offs. So yeah. you have big beds. You got a big open area. How would you feel if this fridge? was big and tall right here, uh, taking up your airflow. Wouldn't, this wouldn't look like this. Correct. Yeah. They're going for a look, they're going for a feel, mm -hmm. and part of that is losing the big fridge. Yeah. Now the Travato G has the big fridge. Yeah. But a guy like me, I feel a little more closed in. Mm -hmm. This, I feel like I can dance like a lady in sound, sound of Music. Yeah. Yeah. Sister Mary, was that her name? Um, uh, Sound of Music was like almost 40 it's a, years ago. It's in Austria. I went and visited yeah. that house in Salzburg, Austria. Oh, you actually. did? Actually, I did. Oh, I can't okay. remember her name. Oh. Flor Floride Maria. See, this you should know since I your should. name is Schmidt. Uh, my name is yeah. Schmidt. Yes. <laughs> so, freezer, fridge, eco hot, which is, which is there. You can preheat the water so you don't have to run it to get it hot. Oh, okay. So when you're running water, get it hot, you're doing two things. You're wasting fresh water and you're filling your gray tank. So two bad, two things you don't want to do. Okay. So what this does is you just turn it, turn it there. And, and wait for it, the light and, to come on. And it's preheating the water. Once it's hot, you just use it. Oh, okay. So pretty okay. sweet system that they- That's cool to have it there. Yeah, yeah. And I'm noticing something that's a big deal in a van this Convection, size. Convection, microwave. That's a big deal, Nick. What would your buddy do? The big uh, do 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 uh, convection do, 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 do. microwave. Yeah. That is cool. Yeah, very neat. Um, not my favorite location being down low, but right. it's a convection microwave. I'd rather have a convection microwave down low than not have a convection microwave. Yeah, I mean, so, you know, not everyone necessarily is going to use it, but I correct. prefer that for heating up stuff. Hundred percent convection. Hundred percent for heating up things. Over mic microwave when, doesn't heat up that great to me. When my though. kids were young, right now they're like mm -hmm. seventeen to ten years old. So mm -hmm. I got four kids. Mm -hmm. When they were younger, and we would go camping. I would bake them cookies in a convection microwave, and they yeah. thought it was the coolest thing right. in the world <laughs> that we're in an RV baking cookies. Right. Like I, you know, the things yeah. that amaze kids is yeah. just it's amazing. I bet you they don't get amazed by that. They don't. They? It, it takes a little more money <laughs> yeah. normally to yeah, amaze now them now. Come up with some Expensive I have to door dash them Chick Fil A or something to school and impress their friends. You know? Right. So little compartment right here. Let me bend yeah. down here and open this for you. Look at that. Oh, look at that. Very neat. Lots of storage. In yeah, there. and you can wait. Is that, and you can is lock another it. plug in there. They I don't know. Do no. Oh, okay. No, 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 no. You can lock it as well. Yeah. Um. There is another plug back there. We found number thirteen. Okay. Oh my goodness. Let me see. Oh my goodness. You gotta fold this table. I can handle this. <laughs> this is way too many plugs. I do not deserve this, Hank. I do not deserve okay. this many plugs. <laughs> Let me show you number 13. I can't see it there, but it's right you. there. You see it, people? You saw it. Yeah. There's a lot. Plug number there's 13, a, Hank. There's a lot in this, man. There I'm is. actually surprised at how much stuff there is in here. And, uh, you know, this is a really cool, this is a really cool setup. Seriously, no kidding. Those, like, if it doesn't have all-wheel drive, which, you know, I'm crazy about that. And it's, you know, for if you're a bigger dude like me, you might want a little bit more room. But this is really close, that we were saying in the beginning, 
to having a lot of good things in it. We do need to show everyone, of course, oh, yeah. how to do this here. Do I need to go outside for that? Um, no, you want to stay inside? I'll go outside. Yeah, check yeah. it out. So, pretty neat. You can do it from inside or outside. There's just two little hooks right here or clips. Very easy. Yeah, and you down, drop it. Down, so, down. pretty neat. There. Okay. And there. So now, two seconds later, you have a full screen. Then, if you want to come in and out, you just move it to the side. Okay. You can walk in, and then you just put it down. And there is Velcro on it as well. If you really want it, like if you have a cat or some type of of animal inside the coach, it's a magnet oh, it's ma and oh, it's magnetized. It's magnet it? and Velcro. Oh, cool. So okay. right now, it is totally safe to keep your pet in there as long as they don't go bulldozing through it. Yeah. Then when you want to come in, there's a little well, handy. Yeah. Right there. If they go bulldozing through it, it's not going to hurt it. I guess it's not gonna, it might hurt away. the animal. Yeah, depending on what kind of beast. <laughs> Maybe. You got a nice big dog, he's getting through this. But no, this is cool. Oh, I found number 14, Hank. Holy there cow. What am I going to do with myself? It's too much places to plug things in here. I don't even know if this thing can what are, 14 plugs. What are these switches down here? So that is your awning. This is your power awning switch and your awning light. Oh, okay. So since all these things are on switches, um, you can you control them from an app or not? Uh, yes, you can come on outside okay. if you like. By the way, look. Nice handle. No, ram mount. Oh, I didn't even that's think a, about that. That's a handle and a ram mount. Pretty sweet. Yeah, I like that. Dude, I could put a you know GoPro on the door so I could see me coming and go. I don't know I why. <laughs> don't know why either. I don't know why Sounds I need a it. Creepy. But yes, where yeah. else do you have GoPros, Hank? Uh, everywhere, anywhere, everywhere so, and anywhere. <laughs> very nice screen, nice big opening. People love these Pro Masters because they have such a nice big opening. You don't have to duck the in and out. Mm -hmm. You can stand up tall, walk in and out of them, mm -hmm. all that. So very, very happy that we are Winnebago dealers, that we can represent something like this, make it available to you guys, that me and Hank can cut up and do this video and show you guys all the cool stuff yeah. about a Winnebago. You know, something that we do in Gainesville is we keep these things in stocks. So we have the, the Travados, the Solaces, the Eras, the Bolts, all, all of the Winnebago Class Bs we try to have here so, you, so people can come here and look at them and drive them and roll around on the bed like I just did and do, yeah. and, and see how you're gonna, everyone's gonna use it different. Some people use yeah. it for an office, some people use it for camping, some people just use it to haul their grandkids around because their kids love it. So there's a lot of different things, but wherever you're at in the country, we will fly you here to Gainesville, Florida, if you're interested in this. Okay. You're and if you want it, that. we're still doing that. And if you want us to deliver it to your house, we'll deliver it to you for free anywhere in the country. It doesn't so, matter where it is, anywhere in the country, we will deliver this RV for free to your front door. So price on this. So price on this, this, I don't exactly know the full MSRP, right. but I know we're somewhere under like 119-ish, okay. I think is what we're selling them for, fully loaded. So. Option wise, the leather seats, the painted bumpers, the the um, these windows here, it's like a two thousand dollar option. Yeah. The windows here, the upgraded cabinetry. Yeah. I, mean, I think that's something we actually didn't talk about, Nick. What's that? This has leather seats. It does. That is yeah. an option from Winnebago. Yeah, these are, yeah. So so in this leather seat op like this is fully loaded then. Oh every every option that Winnebago allows okay. us to put on one of these, we put on them. When oh, okay. we order the lithium models, we order the extra battery pack and everything else. When we order the non-lithium, which some people would rather yeah. save the money and not have lithium, mm -hmm. we order them with every option still. These windows, I, I couldn't imagine having one without them. I mean I mm -hmm. I just think they're so great. The lead I love leather seats personally, so I think they're great. Yeah. You know, all all of the stuff. I like that color cabinets. Now that's a preference. Right. You know, so there's a lot of cool things about this specific Winnebago that I like and I think I think you would like as well. If you're going for a ProMaster, this actually has a lot of stuff in here. It does. So if you said to me like you can only, you know, you can only pick a ProMaster that we've we've looked at a bunch of these we have. this we have. year. Yep. I really, Road Trek makes a nice ProMaster, yeah. Coachman makes a nice one. And, yeah. and Winnebago definitely makes a nice one. So I think they, these are definitely top line. There's, this is high up on my list. I would this say is, this, this, is, is. this is like in the top three, you know, of yeah, the oh yeah, nicest ones that we've seen. I know 100%. we've looked at some cool stuff like with the pop top. Yep, yep the uh, pop top. So the Winnebago yeah. has a pop top, so does Road right. Trek. Yeah, but this, the layout of everything that we've just seen here and all the room yep. and all that, seriously, if, if I was looking for a ProMaster, I would really think about that. Yeah, no, yeah. between this that's, and the Coachman to me with the rear bath models, yeah. They make the two the best two rear bath models, quality right. wise, mm -hmm. lithium systems, all of it. They make the two best 
yeah. rear bath models like this. I think it comes down to the little things that you that you would want out of it. Correct. Like, do you want the um, do you want a certain kind of furniture in yep. there, yeah. or like wood cabinetry and yep. things like that? But man, this has a lot of this has a lot of cool stuff. It does. All right, so Nick. For the folks out there who would yes. like to actually find out more about this or maybe something else you guys have here on the lot, yeah. So you where know, do you they go? Check out our website, uh, sunshinestaterv's.com. We are in Gainesville, Florida, so you know we'll fly you in from anywhere in the country. And if you don't want to come to Florida, which I don't know why you wouldn't, but if you don't, free delivery anywhere in the United States on any of these. We carry Coachman, Winnebago, Road Trek, American Coach, tons of really cool Class B RVs. Okay, awesome. Thanks so much, Nick. Yeah, man. Thank you, See sir. See you on the next one. Appreciate you. <laughs> okay, guys, don't forget to like, share, subscribe to the channel. We'll see you next time.